What's up guys, I'm Tech Steve, and on today's video, I'm gonna show you some new sunglasses from Bose. Of all people, Bose. Bose is one of those companies that are really known for making great speakers, but how well do they make glasses? Well, the cool thing about these glasses is that they have a technology called AR that allows you to hear sound around you as well as immerse you into the audio that you listen to on your device. It also has an equalization that you can take it up to that next level. So sit back and relax, and let me tell you all about them. When they made these sunglasses, they made them available in two different sizes. If you're looking for the smaller fit, you can go with the Rondos. And those are also going to come with the carrying case, a charging cable, and a cloth bag. Now, if you're looking for something larger, you want to go with the Altos. These frames are larger, and you can see the range and the charging time is exactly the same. So now let me show you what you get in the box with the Alto. So what do you guys think? I think they look pretty cool. Now let's take a closer look at them so you can see the controls, the speakers, and then I'll show you how to download the application to get them all up and running. First of all, the case they come in is very premium. Talking about a custom fit, they fit nicely inside as well as when you close it up, it's got a magnetic door that keeps it closed. These frames are very light even though they have an audio system in them. Another thing I like about them is they have these gold nice brackets in there and it's very thick, so it's less likely to wear out on you. On the bottom of them, you have these nice audio vents and speakers back here, so you can hear the sound really nice in your ear, and it doesn't affect other people. And to charge them is very easy. They come with this USB charger. You just stick it inside, and it clips right on. Now, it takes about two hours of charging, and out of that, you're going to get about three hours of streaming time of nonstop listening. Now, with these headphones, you can make phone calls, change tracks, and do other features. Here's the power button. In order to turn it on, you put the headphones this way, and then you tap the power button, and you can hear voice prompts in your ear. And to turn them off, you just turn them upside down for about two or three seconds, and then you can fold them, and they're ready to go. To save battery life, they turn themselves off about five minutes if they're in the folded position, or there's no audio source going through them. Now I'm gonna show you how to install the Bose Connect application. You don't need this application unless you want to be able to control some of your music players using Google's Assistant or Siri. You can still connect it to your device like a regular Bluetooth headphone and still use the music player like normal. To get them up and running is very easy. You go to your Android or Apple's App Store and type in Bose Connect. Download the application once you find it. Go ahead and open up the application and agree to the terms and conditions. Now it's time to put the sunglasses in pairing mode. All you need to do is open them up and press the power button for two seconds. As soon as I put in pair mode, you'll see your sunglasses appear and drag your finger down to start the process. Next thing you need to do is go into the settings of your phone and open up the Bluetooth. Now that we're in the Bluetooth mode, go ahead and select Bose frames. And now they're connected. At this time, you can give them a name if you like. You could take a quick tour. Once you look at some of the different things you can do with it, you can then press got it. Then press OK. Now you can press ready to play. At this point, they're all set up and ready to go so you can start playing any of your music that you already have stored in your phone. But let's take this step farther and I'll just show you the basics of how to get it set up if you have premium Apple Music. If you're using an iPhone, just press on music then press get started. You'll have to have the paid version of Apple Music for us to work. In most cases, it's about $10 a month. So I switched over to my new device because I didn't have the Apple's premium installed on my demo phone. So let me show you how to use the controls. First of all, make sure your device is connected on the main screen. If you hit the three lines in the corner, you can then go into music settings, and then you can connect to Apple's Music or TuneIn, but keep in mind you have to have the premium version. If you click on Apple's Music, you can hide different things that you don't want to see by using the toggles. Now I'm going to show you how you can use the power button to switch to your different tracks. If you just want to change tracks, you can slide in the app like this. If you make it full screen, then you can see what's playing. And to go to the next track, you have pressed the power button twice really quick.
And if you want to go back to the previous track, press the power button three times. Now you can also use these glasses to trigger your voice commands to be able to make outgoing phone calls. Let me show you an example of that. All you need to do is press and hold down the power button until you get the Siri command. Call 611. Calling 611. In order to hang up, just press it one time. And if you have an Android device, it also works with the Google Assistant. Now I want to listen to some music and see how good it sounds. You can press it once to pause it. Wow. So here's what I think. These glasses are very nice. One thing that lacks for me is they don't have a lot of bass response. But it's a different kind of experience because it doesn't have this over the ear feeling or in the ear feeling. It's like this feeling that surrounds you. It sounds really good. And uh, I let a few of my friends listen to them and they like the sound of them too. So if you're looking for a lot of bass response, these glasses are not for you. If you're looking for something that sounds really good and clean, that immersion sound, and you can go down to the beach and listen to music with having the earphones in, I think you'll really like these. Here's the last few things that you need to know about these glasses. First of all, the lenses are not polarized, but they're UVA 99% protection, so that still works really good in the sun. Also, they do not connect to Wi-Fi, so everything is done through the application or connected to Bluetooth Direct. Also, they're not waterproof, so if you get them wet, they are less likely to get damaged unless you're in just a little bit of mist. But overall, I really like the concept and Bose really delivered on these. And they cost about $199 and I'll leave a link to the Bose website below if you're interested. And if you like more videos like this, be sure to go ahead and give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.